Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. My name is Shiraj and this is Android Editing. This video is going to be very helpful for the creators, especially those who wants to make voiceover video using their mobile phone. Now in this video, we will see certain applications and we will see certain factors that will help you in improving your audio quality using your mobile phone. Okay, so the first thing and the most basic thing is finding a suitable environment for recording. I suggest you to go to any room and close the door and windows for some time and make sure the fan is turned off because that makes a lot of noise. Okay, so the next thing we need is an application that can record our audio in a very good quality. So for this purpose, the app called as Smart Recorder is the best app available on Play Store. So you can download the app from Play Store and then simply record your audio using this application and then save it to gallery. Okay, now pay attention to whatever I say. Never pause or stop your recording in between. I know a lot of you do mistakes when you record something. Even I do mistakes, but never pause or never stop the recording in between. If you do any mistakes, simply wait for a few seconds and then start again. But never stop in between. Remember this thing. And then once you have said everything, you can pause the video or you can stop the video. Now you must be thinking how we can remove the unwanted parts or the mistake part from the audio. So you can easily do this in KineMaster. You have to simply import the audio in KineMaster and then by trim and the cut feature you can trim the audio or you can cut the unwanted parts from the audio. And finally you will get the perfect result or the perfect audio which you want without any mistake or without any unwanted parts. Now comes the most important part of this video which is editing the audio and which application we will use to edit the audio. So for this purpose we will use an application which is called as Audio Lab. I have been using this application for one year now and for me this application is the best application for editing audio in mobile. You can download this application from Play Store, link will be given in the description box. Okay, so once you open the application Audio Lab, this is the first look which you get here. And as you can see, there are so many options. Even there is an option to record the audio, but uh, we will not use this application for recording. As I said, we will use the Smart Recorder application for recording the audio because it gives more better result. So after you have recorded the audio in Smart Recorder, we have to open this Audio Lab application and then here if you scroll down you will get an option called as audio effects click on the audio effects option and uh, basically you will find all your recordings here now for example i am selecting this option this recording and here again we have uh, so many effects which you can apply we will apply the crystallizer effect and it will ask you for strength crystallizer strength 1 2 3 4 and 5 so we will keep it at 1 and it will create the preview or it will save the effect which you applied and so now the crystallizer effect is added to the audio and now we will click on the tick sign to apply it or to save it okay so it is saved we will go back and select the new one which is just saved one and we have already applied the crystallizer effect so now we'll apply some different effect which is the base effect so we'll click on the base one and we will set the base to 10 of course you can adjust it as you want but these are the settings which i find to be perfect so i will go for this i will set the base to 10 and treble at 0 and click on OK. It will create the preview. And then we will click on the tick to save the changes. That's it. Once again, we'll go back. And we came back to the main home page. So we just saw how the audio effects option works. Okay, so now we will click here noise remover. And we will select the recording which is just saved 
So this recording already has the crystallizer effect and the bass effect, right? And now we will remove this noise from it, the background noise from it. The noise which is usually the noise of your mic because it keeps moving or it's not very stable when you record. So we have to remove that noise. So there are so many kind of noise which we can remove. The one which we are looking for is the remove select noise. Here you do not have to change any setting. You can multiply the effect by one times or two times but uh, I prefer to keep it at one so I will not change it. I will keep it at one and then I will click on OK. It will take some time to preview. The longer your recording is, the longer the time it will take to preview. So you have to wait for some time. So as you can see now, the remove select noise is already applied. And yeah, that's it. Now we'll click on the tick sign to save it. And the recording is saved. Okay, now I'll play the preview to show you the before and after audio recording sample. Just be thinking how we can remove the unwanted parts or the mistake part from the audio. So you can easily do this in KineMaster. You have now you must be thinking how we can remove the unwanted parts or the mistake part from the audio master. Okay, so that was the before and after recording sample. And uh, before ending the video, let's quickly see a summary of all the points. First point: you have to record in a proper noise-free environment. For this, you can go to your room, close the door and windows. For some time and then you can record also make sure you turn off the fan because that makes a lot of noise second point you need an application to record the audio so for this purpose the best application available is smart recorder link is given in description third point for editing the audio you need an application which is called as audio lab again audio lab is the best application for editing the audio in android link is given in description available in play store Fourth point, we have to like, comment and subscribe the channel because that will really help me a lot. Okay guys, so that's all for this video. I really hope you have learned something new from this video. I will see you again in the next one and that's all. Stay creative and stay healthy. I don't know where I am, I don't know where you take me, I don't know where you take me. I just follow your trail and I'm losing your mind and I'm losing your head. Get from me some love cause I'm a prisoner I just want to look my way and never back to you